Okay, so there are. <laughs> Sweet food or salty or sour? Cheese. <laughs> Ready, Amy? Hey, I'm Christina. I'm Catherine. I'm Amy. I'm Lauren. And, and we're, we're Cimarelli. We are all sisters and we love making music together. We upload our videos on Cimarelli Saturdays. Woo! So guys, Yeehaw. today we're here for a very exciting video. As you already know from the title, it is the gender reveal for this Ooh, one. Woo! This child. So I'm gonna go through the old wives tales first, which you guys probably know what that is. It's where you say like, if you're carrying hi, it's a girl. Or if you're doing this, it means it's a boy. And like, they're not really scientifically based. They're just kind of fun. And then the girls are gonna come back and we're gonna do a very unique and special gender I'm so reveal. so concerned. Involving wigs. Love a wig. Because if it's us, it's gotta involve wigs. It's gotta yeah, have a of wig. Of course. <laughs> And also, disclaimer, we all know the gender. So we all found out together. Max and I didn't find out our ultrasound. We waited and like found out with our family like a week later or whatever. So yeah, we all already know, but we're gonna tell you what our guesses were before we found out. My guess, which I'm wearing, is a girl. My guess, which I'm not wearing, is a boy. <laughs> <laughs> I think I probably was leaning towards boy, mm. but I wasn't like, oh my gosh, I just know. Yeah, at first I was like, oh, it could be a girl. That was my vibe. <laughs> Then wow. the day, the morning of the day, I thought about it and I was like, oh, we're gonna go do it. What do I think it is? And I was like, it's a boy. All right, we're gonna get our wigs for the reveal and Kat's gonna do the old wives tales, so let's go. Okay, so we're gonna do the old wives tales, the gender predictions. This is my tally board and Ariel's gonna read them. Pregnancy glow, yes or no? I mean, I people so. have said that and they said that last time, but I'm like, are they just lying to make me feel better? So is that boy glow or girl? Glow is boy. Okay. Is your body temperature high or low? High. That means girl. Okay. Cravings, sweet food or salty or sour? Cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Literally just dairy. That's salty? So that would be a boy. Okay. <laughs> Morning sickness? Well, I had it for a month. So I guess, I, yes, I had it. Girl. Okay. Do you have swollen legs or ankles? No, which I did last time really bad. Girl. Okay. Would you describe yourself as extra clumsy? I am always so clumsy. How do I know if that's gotten worse? Yeah, I would say extra. Yeah, I would say probably more than usual. Boy, have you had more frequent headaches? Yes. Boy. Okay. Your bump shape. Would you describe it as sticking out straight or more round? What? Sticking out straight like it's a line? I don't. <laughs> I mean, I feel like it's kind of round. It's not like. <laughs> Boy. Okay. Have you had any heartburn? Yes. Boy. But then last time I had horrible heartburn and it was two boys. The, is the baby's heartbeat under 140 or over? I think it was 150, so over. Girl, has your partner been gaining weight? No, <laughs> ever gained <laughs> weight. Oh boy. Curse you, Max, I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. Been more moody or mellow? Moody, just crying a lot. Girl, are your hands soft or dry? Dry, but it's winter. But they're very dry. Boy. They're always dry in the winter. <laughs> and last but not least, do you have a line on your abdomen? No, and that is the weirdest thing. I had this last time with the twins and I don't this time. So isn't that weird? Girl. So it's a girl, okay. Okay, so the total is six girl and eight boy. All right, let's bring in the dancing lobster session. <laughs> let's bring in the girls and find out. Okay, so there are <laughs> Three people. You probably don't recognize Three them. Three beautiful women. I'm Sorry. like Kathleen because I forgot what I look like. And two of them have the correct gender and one of them has the wrong gender. On our wigs that we are wearing under so, our clothes if that was not clear. The wig, when we get two total wigs of the same color, then we know we have revealed the gender of this okay. child. All right, it's time for the reveal. Ready, Amy? <laughs> Let's hey, go. Let's freaking go. Guys, so. I think my wig is not even on anymore. Let's so. see the color. <laughs> okay, it's a girl. No, no, not yet, you don't know. Gotta wait to see the other colors. Okay, so we got one pink. We got one pink. What could it be? Bigfoot <laughs> <laughs> turquoise, baby! <laughs> one pink, one blue. What in the future? What is it gonna be? Lauren, okay, here, here we go, here we go, here we go. Holds the I will reveal. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ah, I'm so nervous. Da 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 Lauren was the perfect choice for this. Yeah, Lauren really <laughs> So guys, if you didn't know, 
also be my third boy. I'm officially Yay! a boy mom. Already you're officially a boy mom. I feel like three though, I'm like really a boy mom. Like, yeah, whoa, you're deep in boy, boy mom, mom life in okay. that. Yeah, boy mom, woo. So you made Lauren, that me. color is actually not bad for your skin tone. She just I had this, this color. color. <laughs> so I would hope so. That's so touchy. Okay, <laughs> snorting over here. <laughs> my oh my ears. gosh. So you guys may be wondering how I felt when I found out. How do you feel? We're like, definitely what? wondering. Yeah, well, no, not you guys. Because so. <laughs> people always like, oh, you're having another boy. Oh, are yeah. you crushed to the core? Did you want a girl? Because like, people always assume, oh, if you have a boy, you definitely want a girl. Here's how hey, I felt. Yeah, twins Honestly, boys. I thought it was a girl, but that doesn't mean I wanted it to be a girl. I wanted whatever the Lord wanted. Amen. So I'm excited. I'm excited to have three boys. And I also would love to have more children in the future. So mm. I don't really see this as the end. It's not like this is my final child. But either way, even if I had 10 boys, I'd be happy. So love anyway, that. I'm excited to have another boy. <laughs> it's already crazy boy energy in my house and it's gonna get even worse, so. Good luck to you, sis. Yeah, get some, get some elbow pads for me. I wonder if they'll look exactly like twins. That's what I was wondering too. Is this little baby gonna be like a triplet to the twins or gonna be like so, so different. different? I kind of hope he'll have like black hair because Max has black, had black hair as a baby and I had like blonde and the twins are kind of blonde. So mm -hmm. I'm like, I kind of want something different like black. All right, everyone, what's your name suggestions? If you're going off of Dominic, Leopold. Yeah, comment your name. What should the third boy, it's gotta be strong. Dominic and Leopold and, what was Great. it? Hat trick. <laughs> okay. Francisco. Saint Francisco. Saint That's a good one. Francisco. Well, thank you guys for being a part of this journey. And I'm excited for all of us to meet this child in yeah. March of 2024. Aww. Yeah, make sure you click subscribe, join the Sim Fam, and follow along on Kat's journey. Blessings upon you and your family. <laughs> Hallelujah. Thanks for watching. We love the Sim Fam. To not feel hopeless in life regarding romantic relationships. It's gonna change and you gotta embrace where you are.